The following program is intended for mature audiences. What you got going on yourself, what worked for you, what's best for you. A lot of people be so stuck on like watching everything and everybody else or looking at social media all day and it's like mm. they dictate their life off of what everybody else doing. Right. You ain't gonna get there like that. You know what I'm saying? I saw your uh, Twitter rant about people like being stuck on clout. And how do you feel like you don't succumb to being stuck on like what's popping on social media and stuff like that? I don't know. It's like some shit. Like it's just in you. And it ain't. Right. That shit just ain't in me. You be on there often, or you just don't even really. Everybody be on social media, but it's like y'all yeah. know the ones you can look and tell the ones it's just they live their life right. on mm -hmm. social media. You know what right. I'm saying? You the know how to it's like the shit Drake just sitting there around like people having more followers than dollars. Mm. And that shit just the honest to God truth. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And some people ain't got the followers yet, but they ain't thinking about the dollars. They thinking about the number of them followers. They want them followers. Mm. They ain't even really stuck on the dollars. Like, they want them followers. They want that attention. It used to be called attention. Like, everybody used to want attention. It just translated now to the followers. Everybody want them views and them followers. And it's cool, but goddamn, like, <laughs> come on now. I mean, them followers right. do sometimes turn into dollars. Yeah, but at the same time, it shit, some people don't know. They ain't, that's not resonate with them. They wanna, they just wanna like be in the mix. They just wanna, they just want talking and gossiping and shit to be going on. Like right. that shit ain't about it. Gossiping don't get you shit. They ain't, I don't know, man. Right, it's I like, might be wrong, but I don't know. You make it work for you how you, how you want to use it as a tool, right? Yeah, it's exactly. Easy. It's like don't get me wrong. You gotta you get your shit up. It's not like, I look at social media, it's all about money. Like, I mm -hmm. look at everything about money. Bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you run your shit up, you know what I'm saying? Like, get your money off of it. But a lot of people, they not, they ain't, they ain't trying to do that. Mm. They just right. want to, like, be in the gossip topics and the gossip situation, right. the, the talk and the attention. Like, mm -hmm. fuck the money. I don't know who raised them, where they get that shit from. <laughs> nah, get that up off your mind. <laughs> it might just be where I'm from. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, bro, I'm from Memphis, and it's like everything about paper with us. You know what right. I mean? It's like everything. You know what I mean? It's like we're going to find the littlest, the bullshittest thing, whatever we into, we're going we gonna to go back to the shit. Do we got anything to do with money? You know what right. I'm saying? Like, if it ain't got nothing to do with money, that shit ain't got nothing to do with me. So... R. Kelly girlfriend, Jocelyn Savage mama, Georgeline Savage, jumped on the internet again looking for attention. This time from Kelly Price. What had happened was Kelly Price did an interview with Vlad TV. Lunell, the comedian, conducted the interview. She was asked about R. Kelly and she said what she said. She didn't say anything about the savages. As a matter of fact, she didn't say anything about any of the girls involved. I honestly believe she don't even know them. So Georgia Lynn Savage is out of order again. She told that lady to tread lightly. I think she meant tread lightly. Kelly Price was offended and so was the internet. The internet gave that lady the business about Kelly Price. In my opinion, it's like that family is stalking R. Kelly name on the internet. Every time somebody do an interview or make a YouTube video, here they come. He been in jail for years. And they daughter sitting up waiting on him to get out. Jocelyn Savage don't want to have anything to do with her family. And that's her choice. She has made that very clear. As a matter of fact, when she did talk to them and go home to visit, she got interrogated. What I want to know from Kelly Price is why is it when artists are no longer signed to a label, they tell all. But when they sign to a label, they hush hush. And exactly what did she mean by girls that want a career a lot of times? will do whatever is necessary to have one. What's necessary other than their talent? And George Dylan Savage, if you wanted us to come to your page 
to read what TMZ reported about James Mason, why you just didn't say that? And the thing about it is, we don't care about James Mason. We never did. Y'all probably don't even know that man. Y'all probably never even seen that man face to face. Only thing y'all did probably was converse by phone. So those charges y'all put on that man, bogus. According to Angelo Clary, y'all lied on that man. And that's probably why the case was dismissed. Because y'all couldn't prove y'all case. Y'all daughter was grown when she met R. Kelly. She's grown now. That girl has told y'all on several occasions. She good. Leave her alone. At this point, y'all stalking y'all own daughter. If she don't want to have anything to do with y'all, then so be it. It is what it is. She's no longer a child. She's not a little girl. She's a young lady. All that stuff y'all said about that girl on social media and in mainstream media. I don't blame her for not wanting to talk to y'all or come around y'all. Y'all said some very embarrassing and disrespectful things about y'all own daughter. The internet tore John and up so bad, she deleted the whole post. But I kept some of them comments. It was lit. So, when John Jalen Savage got done watching Kelly Price's interview on Vlad TV, she went to Instagram and said, at J Savage Collections, at Miss Kelly Price, for whatever reason, other moms were backstage or in business meetings at the studio. It doesn't give him the right to recruit for his cult. Let's say your mom was backstage with you doing legitimate business moves in the industry. Does that automatically mean you back there not for your talent and just as a groupie? No, it does not. What he did to my family and I is inhumane and all who knew should be brought to justice along with him, like at Kevin Giles, at Cheryl Mack, etc., who turned a blind eye. I encourage you to thread lightly. Hey, I'm going to make this really, really quick. Um, and I'm going live because if you're crazy enough to come and threaten me, I'm going to put you out there. Be really careful about telling me that I need to tread lightly if you're not prepared to back up what you say. Okay? I said what I said, and I can stand behind everything that I said. I was raped as a kid. I was also molested. I would never stand behind someone who is doing the same thing. I said what I said, and I meant what I said. I said what I had to say about R. Kelly. He's in jail right now. I also said that I believe that that's where he belongs because where there's smoke, there's fire. But please, Miss Savage, you threatened me and you told me I should tread lightly. You don't know me like that. You don't know me like that. I have nothing to do with what your family went through. I wasn't around when y'all were around. I will never stand in the corner of a rapist. I will never stand in the corner of somebody who is violent towards women or children. But it sounds like a hit dog is hollering right now. I never said anything about your family. The statement that I made was about the industry as a culture and I stand on it. Young girls and women, period, have not been safe in this business because they've been preyed upon. And people have known that girls that want a career, a lot of times, will do whatever is necessary to have one. Unfortunately, sometimes their parents want them to have one so bad that they will facilitate that process. Now, if that wasn't your mama, why are you worried about it? I never said I saw your mama backstage with you. Matter of fact, I actually didn't even say that I saw any, but my exact phrase was, I never saw R. Kelly with underage girls. He never brought them around me. He never did anything like that around me. I said what I said. Be very careful. Don't start something that you can't finish because I don't play that. You told me to tread lightly. I'm glad you said it, and I'm glad you said it openly. But if you're not that girl, don't make those kind of threats because you might have to show up on it. And I don't think you're ready for that either. Here at the trail, um, I'm going to show you guys actually our view 
um, so you guys can know it's real. Um, it's Grammys back there, you know, so, um, yeah, we're here at the Trump, and, um, you know, Joy's parents are all over social media. Yeah, they, they know where I'm at. Yeah, we've been here at the Trump, you know, we've been here for years. Um, we move freely, we come and go freely. We actually just left out this morning, and nobody said anything to us, you know, no one stopped us, no one, you know, harassed us or anything like that, so, um... We just wanted to clear that up and let you guys know that that is fake news and do not believe everything that you hear. Um, other than that, we want to say thank you to all of Robert's fans. Um, we see the support that you guys are showing him all over social media, Twitter, Instagram, everything. We see you guys going in and we are just so thankful for the prayers, for the love, for the support, everything that you guys are yes. saying and doing and trying to do to help him. We are just so thankful. It no parents, girl. Mm -hmm. I've never had, hello mom, hi dad, I've never had that ever. But I'm not a drug addict and I'm not a prostitute. Please. I'm begging you, please. This is not the way to go. I'm not telling you that you have to be like, okay, you're saying okay now because you want me to shut up because that's how you be. But I'm just saying that at the end of this, if you leave, it's the end. I yeah. had a dream. I'm trying to tell you. you please. Uh, Anna, what? It was like um, it was like this, and I was so sure because I I had seen a house down there, and my dream in the house was that house at the you know when you first turn in that house. That's the first house that I saw, and I was like, oh, I thought this was y'all house, but it wasn't. It was this one, and it was like um, Joy was here. And she was wearing like all black, and you guys were here, but you guys were like you were like yelling at her, and she was like in a you know those black holes. And she was like swirling in it and you were trying to get her just like I was scared just now when you were on top of her just now that's how it was that's how it was and then she was leaving and then her dad was like yelling and I saw her sister and the little one was like she was like joy come back please come back come back and she was like no and she left and she never came back and it's freaking me out because she had a dream that she found her and the boy's nope. murder the years ago you know what I had this dream last night Last night. Last night. And what was the last one I talked to? Last night. It's two coincidences that I'm in this same, and I saw that same house. It's I'm freaked out. I was freaked out when I came. The house I'm freaked the out. Right there when we first turned in. Yeah. I'm freaked out. Please. You can't. I told you. I was like that. Even at the beginning, and I'm sure that you even understand what I'm saying, because at the beginning of the semester, when that when he had cut you off for a little bit of some time, did we not have fun? Was life not good? He yes cut or you no? out because of juice, right? He didn't cut me off. Um, didn't that time that he was mad at you for two weeks. He didn't cut me off. He was just mad. Because okay, but he wasn't was speaking you, to you. It wasn't the same. Why was he mad you? weren't you. going there. Because I rolled my eyes. And hey, Juice. Yeah. Juice is no longer with him right now because she, because I've been told she starts training all the girls she needs to train. They will bring her back when she can train more girls. I've already been getting the information. What? Yes. The same girl you rolled your eyes at. She's no longer with him right now because she's been trying all the girls she needs to train right now. They will bring her back in when she needs to train more girls. You just confirm that Juice is the girl you rolled your eyes at. Mm -hmm. This is my source, secret source that gives me information. It's so you going to tell me that I'm you. not sure. Okay, yeah. Scaring you it's he cut you out two weeks because of Juice. I mean, that's that's I definitely know about Juice because Juice has been around me a lot. Juice is the one who's trained you. Juice is not trained to do anything. Okay, see, it's not, but the way it's like trained, it's man, not like we're, always, see, but that's, it's I not like, it's, okay, but the thing is that it's not like martial not. arts. This is not like martial arts where you train to learn something. It's, it's, you integrate into it. So you're telling me the first she time she got to Juice, telling, right? You yeah, know, but that's the other girl I usually get a dinner Juice right. is the one who's been with him for years. But I don't know about the other girls. So Juice you're is trying no to, like right now because she's trained all the girls she needs to train. I don't know about all that training stuff. I don't know about all that, but. Let me, Josh, let me break it down for you. Juice is the one like a madam. She the one tells you right. who to have sex with, who she tells right. you how to have sex and girls. all that. She don't do that to me, so. Okay. I mean, I know Juice. But you just nigga, you know Juice. So the girls I'm giving the information from are, is, is accurate because they already told me Juice is no longer with him right now until she time to go back him to train new girls. That's what I'm saying. Joyce, so that's Juice. I mean, I'm giving the information from the people. I know people ain't right. telling you. I'm get, this is real she's people. Right, though. That's, what, that's why I'm saying. I'm giving accurate right. information. This yeah, is just right. Awesome. This is killing me that I'm this baby having that nervous breakdown. I'm getting information from people daily. Give me true information. She's right. It's scary. There's nothing that she just 
that was a lie. That's the same thing when she came to me over Thanksgiving break. There's nothing that she or your dad told me that they oh, never God. lied. It was the it was the exact thing. Which is they, who is they? Who is they? I don't know who he is. Why are you talking? I'm ready to go. Like, why am I still here? You don't know who he is? Why are we still here? It's only been one time. I okay. What was her name? That's it, but I only have What was her name, Joe? Okay. What was her name? No, I'm, I'm feeling the call. What was her name? Just call him. Just read about who's about to call him. What was her name? What was her name? Oh, my God. What was her name? Please Ray call him. Please Ray call him right, right, call him. Right, right, call him right now. He's like, I'm looking at him about to call him. I Please answer the question. Okay. He's about to. Her name's April. It's one Who is April? Joy. It's Joy. Not. Please. Who is April? Please. It's here. Please. Who is April? Okay. Please tell the truth. Okay, why are you trying to call Who her? Who is April? Okay, you tell him don't try. Who is April? Um, I'm sorry. I just. Mr. Who is April? So you had sex with her. Who is April? Is that one of his girls too? Let me I only had sex with one, uh, one person. That's Who is it. April? Oh my god. So R. Kelly made you have sex with another girl? Let me call this nigga. You know, you know, you know, I'm cursing his ass out. He, he made you have sex with another girl? Make me have sex with you want girl. to have sex with her? No, I didn't. Oh my god. You didn't want to have sex with yeah. her. Who is April? Who is April? Who's April? Who is April? Oh. <laughs> Who is April? Please. Who is April? This oh is getting god. old. Who is Why April? Why do we keep talking about R. Kelly? R. Kelly made you have sex with another girl? No, so how did it happen? Did you want to have sex with him? Oh my God. Did you want to have sex with the girl? No, it was just at the moment. Nobody it was at the moment because R. Kelly made you have sex with the girl. That's why you I mean, had sex with the girl. April? Hold on, hold on. What happened? What you mean? R. Kelly wanted you to have sex? No, I no. I'm saying at the moment that was it was at the time, but I it was just a one time thing. That's he had sex with too. What do you mean? I was. Why R. Kelly had sex with too. Uh, I was. You had that. But then I'm trying to say, I don't know anything about anything about the other girl. That's, that's, that's what I'm saying. Get that nigga on the phone. Who is April? Who is April? Please tell the truth. See, these people are keep, they keep asking you. You you know so stop asking me to tell the truth. Who it's is right April? here. Who is they April? all just read. Who is Let's April? See. What are you just read? I'm not I'm not ready to tell you what I just read. We all you need to just read the same thing. Who is Please April? Just start speaking so we can go. Okay. Who is April? Um, okay, April's not real. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Because okay, I'm ready to get about it. It's really Dominique or B, right? Or okay, B. hold on. Mr. Johnson, hold on. Okay, keep going. We just read, so we can go. Please, just okay. say what happened, because we all just read it. Yeah, it was only, only one way. time with B. That's it. The only only one. B, the one yeah. that she told Notice us. they're still asking questions. She's no longer one with him right now. She gave, he gave her all B stuff, right? I, I heard that's she was it. paired with B. I heard that. I already got the information. You but that's a, that was the main girl I would always be with. Other than I I but he that. has other mother girls. That, that's what I heard, right. Johnson. That's, that's what I heard. You were paired with B. She was. Okay. See? I'm not gay. So, I heard. Look, this is you right here. This is destruction. That's how close you are. This shit is not funny. I'm not playing with This me. shit I'm is not funny. R. Kelly already knows about me and Adonis. So he, at this point, he knows everything. No, so that's why Holly. Because he didn't know anything. That's why he asked me. He said, he was like, you gonna tell me the truth. I said, I had sex with another guy. And yeah, he, he was really mad about that. But, but you don't get out of here. He had a whole time set you up. That's why I'm, I know that. I see that now. Because I said, I had a feeling that Holly has contacted Holly me. Holly gave him the number. So, the, the Holly, and he, I thought I asked him, should he said, okay, I don't care if you call him or not. But Holly came home and gave him the number. So what makes her think that he has to? What makes her think that he gonna get rid of me? Because he 